Families who thought they owned their homes are having their deeds sold out from underneath them. Action News Jacks investigator Paige Kelton spoke with a Jacksonville woman in that awful situation. An Action News Jacks investigation last year exposed a company now being sued by a state attorney general for so called predatory lending. Now it's selling off properties, and one local woman says she's having to start all over. I wanted to paint. But once I found out that I did not own the place, I wasn't going to do anything for them. Why? Justine White thought she owned her own home. It turns out she had this, a contract for deed, a high-interest land contract making you financially responsible for a home you have no rights to. We just want to talk about Harbor Portfolio. You're on private property. That's Chad Bowes, president of Harbor Portfolio, which is now selling off its contracts for deed in Florida, including Justine White's. And now what's happening with this new owner? He wants me to refinance it and start over at $45,000 again. White, who says she paid more than $40,000 to Harbor Portfolio over the last seven years, learned the deed to her house had been sold for $31,000 to WM Capital Partners, a company registered in Delaware. All the interest you've paid over the last seven years is gone, essentially. It's not counting towards this new nope. mortgage. Mm -mm. So you've essentially just been paying rent. I guess so. Hi, my name is Paige Kelton. I'm with Action News Jax. I spoke with a representative from WM Capital who confirmed they'd bought up Harbor Portfolio properties in about 20 states. He wouldn't talk about Justine's home, but said their mortgages were lower interest and the buyer has the power to sell the home and collect any appreciation. Okay. Unable to fight the sale of her deed, White tells me she's now having to start over. Even people at the courthouse, the tax collector, um, the property appraiser, they all told me. You need an attorney. But you can't afford an attorney. No. Left with no options, Justine White signed the new mortgage. But she isn't staying, she's selling and is taking this painful lesson in home buying with her. There are no laws in Florida protecting you when you sign a contract for deed. Since there are no appraisals or inspections, there's no third party guarantee that you're getting a good price. While real estate experts advise against them, many low income families still sign them because they don't qualify for a standard mortgage. In the newsroom, Paige Kelton, CBS 47, Fox 30, Action News Jacks.